in you. Thank I you. believed in me too. Pass test. Sorry, I didn't mean to breathe on the ball. <laughs> so, oh, doing that. I'm curious if Jack's going to go duck hunt right away or if he's going to try Mario or I Brawler. If, I wonder if he's like when he's if he's going There's to Mario. go back to any duck hunt soon because he hasn't really been playing much duck hunt. He's been playing a lot of Mario and his Mario's good. <coughs> yeah. I think he's kind of started to embrace one of the higher tier characters because he wants to win and you know, sometimes it's just yeah. easier if you embrace the better character. It's also, I think I also think like, he's expecting that Duck Hunt may not be in Smash Switch. Yeah. Um, yeah. Which, you know, who knows? Yeah. I, I think that's it, too. He wants to brush up on a character that follows the actual fundamentals of the game and, and doesn't play their own game. The good news is like, he has a lot of patience with Mario to begin with because he plays so much Duck Hunt. Yeah. And so he's, he's willing to like let someone try and camp him out and camp back. And he, knows, he knows how to stop it. Game on Smashville. He's doing the ally run. He's yeah. air dodge, he's air dodge, he's air dodge. Oh, he, I thought he was going to just move away and air dodge. Uh-oh, he took a lot of damage for trying to read Mewtwo incorrectly. Oh, Ooh. oh my gosh, he's going for the read already. All right. Yeah, you got to wait yep. till the up tilt launches him and then it'll come on up air. We are only 23 seconds in and these players just keep hitting there, each other. I thought there would be <laughs> more camp. Yeah, I guess, I guess Mewtwo can't really camp out Mario, though. Definitely not. It's just, you know, Burz is usually is more of a passive player, likes to kind of sit back, put pressure on them just by charging Shadow Balls, making them aware that it's there. Yep. And he's kind of, he's been getting his charge, but he's kind of ignored that. There's the shield, shield break. break. This will be tilt. up smash, forward smash. Yeah. It's it no matter what. He's dead. That yeah. was weird. What the heck? <laughs> did you see that, Josh? He did, he did Shadow Ball, and then uh, it was like basically more foot suits, and then he down tilted his shield and it popped it. Yeah. Yes. Uh, one thing I noticed about Burz is when he's playing a character that can usually take his uh, or Spheres, he'll go for something like Down Tilt Shadow Ball, where they might air dodge. Ooh. All right, well, this game was a decent start, and then it just kind of went downhill. Yeah, Burz is carrying this momentum throughout the whole second stop oh, here. Oh, he had the read. I think Jack he just needs to work on comboing a lot of the characters more often, because like, he'll get a grab, and he just doesn't get very much off of it. Like, he got 20% and then struggled getting in. And right now, I think he's having a lot of trouble just getting in through down tilt. Burz is spacing uh, the range of down tilt very well. Yeah. Yeah, Ooh. I, I, I was just going to think of him. I thought you he was going to cape out a shield. Yeah. I was like, you will drop shield now. Yeah. Got him. Like, oh. That was very controlled by Burz's. You know, it started out just 20 seconds of them beating on each other, and then yeah. he ran away with the momentum. Uh, Jackie should try and condition versus the shield more, but instead of falling with nares so much, he needs to space more of the aerials, like back air, back air, or like things that are harder for Mewtwo to punish, since Mewtwo's out of shield option to punish that would be best to be fair, and he probably can't punish that yeah. as fast as Mario can throw out another back air or shield. It seems like when he, when he did try to come in too, he'd kind of land right into that down tilt range when he'd space kind of in front of Mewtwo and not get yeah. the hit. The short hop air dodge reading the nair, or maybe it was reacting. Right. The good news about this is always he, he actually doesn't have to approach. Yep. We're about to see them play a lot more patient, but kind of the way we were expecting last game before we got surprised at the beginning. That, that's cool. He used the clay pigeon to go right through his down tilt. Or, yeah, that was a down tilt. Oh, he misspaced the fair, and that would have been some good damage. Ooh, oh. Nair going right uh, I like going. I like the Nair follow where he read it, read the direction he was landed on and down tilted. All right, ooh, good use of can. Nice. Yeah, good he's, cover. He's really good at using that can to recover. Yeah, he won the air dodge read. Good landing shield. All right, just hitting yep. the can away from him. Pretty much. Oh. oh man, that's that's rough though. He has to be what really careful. Ooh, the Nair beats the fair. I, I think he should continue running away and using Gunman and not trying to focus on on like hitting Mewtwo with a projectile, but stopping his Shadow Ball so he can get a, a slight uh, approach. Because like right there, the Shadow Ball was no longer being guarded. But like for the time that it's being guarded by the Gunman, he can't do anything except to throw it at the Gunman. Yeah. And that gives him like a more safe approach option because he's right up forcing me to the defensive option. Ooh, rough spot to be in once he gets that cross up because oh, he's got to figure out a way to get out. Yeah, Jackie needs to try and start SDIing the Mewtwo forward throw so he takes less damage. I mean, every every bit counts. So taking the minimal amount of oh yeah, he's going for it. 
He has a big lead. I didn't realize I like that. Just uh, strings from the nares. Oh, he reflected the can. Just really late reflect. Play pigeon. Oh, okay. Yep. Good job outranging the nair. I like that. Oh. Ooh. Wow. Dang. Yeah, that was good cop option coverage there. And Jackie, uh, Jackie's just if he plays the way he was playing originally, stock one and doesn't let versus in, but doesn't like let versus camp either, or like makes his camping a little bit weaker. Like we think, oh, that takes grab. Ooh. I think he can do really well if he just yeah, it all takes versus go in. Ooh. He just has to make sure. Okay, that's gonna be up man. No. Alright, good dash attack, keeping him off stage. Oh, I was. Yeah, you can't trade with that. Hit. I was like trying tech it if he get hit by that down air. Yeah. But uh, he got that beefy third hitbox so up air. So, so much beats Shadow Ball, he just has to use it when he knows the Shadow Ball's coming. Uh oh, here's some damage. Oh, oh that would have been such a clean air dodge read, though. I wish that hit because it would have looked so clean. Ooh, oh, that I liked the little can pop the, too, it, almost caught him. That was Tech such it. a good roll read catch with the down air, too, to fall with an up tilt. He didn't get too much off of it, but that. Uh, oh. He was playing really smart against versus that yeah. last stock. Like, I think it just took a bit in the beginning to kind of come into his new game plan. Yeah. It's nothing to feel bad about. Like, he was playing fine.